Right, so thank you for joining me at our property pick of the day. Uh, it might be a little bit loud. We're directly off of Thomas Road. So the name of the subdivision is gonna be Greenwood, uh, Greenway Terrace, sorry about that. Greenway Terrace is a subdivision that ranges anywhere between 19th Avenue all the way up to 23rd Avenue from Thomas Road back to uh, one of the side roads called Virginia. This entire subdivision was compiled around 1954 all consisted of uh, three quarter to one, one and a half acre lots. Uh, beautiful home, no HOA, conveniently located to great restaurants as well as near to the I-17 freeway. So now these are irrigated properties. Uh, and as you can tell, there's, they're, they're older, uh, but there's a, probably about maybe 200 homes in this comp entire subdivision. Now the median sales price for these particular homes and, and specifically is around $495,000, $500,000. This one is listed at exactly uh, $495,000. So let me tell you a little bit about it. It is a three bedroom, two bath, 1,600 square feet, 18,000 square foot lot. Beautiful home, move in ready. They've remodeled it, uh, but it could use some touches. So we're gonna go inside and take a look at it. So let's go ahead and go inside and uh, Let's go. All right, so as you can tell, we're, uh, we're on the outside of uh, this beautiful home that's located off of uh, 23rd Avenue and Thomas Road. It's a three bedroom, two bath, 1,600 square feet. And as you can tell, it is sitting on lots and lots of acreage, lots and lots of square footage, 18,000 to be exact. So there's a lot to offer. So let's go ahead and go inside. We'll take a quick look and uh, get your opinion. All right, now that we've made it on the inside, welcome. This home was constructed again in 1954. So you know that it has stood the test of times. And you can tell that obviously the home is not still looking like 1954 with stainless steel appliances and the gas oven, stove, granite countertop, this beautiful country style kitchen island and then just the really big open floor plan, big, magnificent um, picture window, hardwood floors. And let's go ahead and take a look at the bedrooms. So the first room is located at the, the front of the house, has its own bathroom. So this is a three bedrooms, two, two and a half bath. Good size closets. And it still, it still maintains some of its charm from 1954, but uh, you know, they've made some good touches. And I'll, I'll show you right now specifically where this home maintained its charm from 1954. And that's gonna be in this beautiful, <laughs> lime green kitchen, or I'm sorry, beautiful lime green bathroom. And uh, I, I love the nostalgia of it. I would not be surprised if that was a lead uh, tub. Very heavy, very durable. Uh, but even some of the fixtures, the lighting fixtures and the door handles really give it a little bit more of a modern. But as soon as you walk in there, you definitely feel like you have jumped to the past. And then here is bedroom number two. A nice carpet, neutral white paint. 
and nice window fixtures. And then now on to bedroom three. And this one, they have it staged as a, just kind of a like a hangout area with the little pull-out sofa bed. Closet has plenty of space. Nice room. And then you still have plenty of storage areas right here with your linen closets. And then just kind of your knickknack closet. Hardwood floors in the common area. And then this glass door out back. So this home has been on the market about 15 days. It is vacant. It is irrigated land. And it is ready to be sold. All right, so there you have it. Thank you again for joining us for this property pick of the day. Uh, we wanted just to give you something a little bit versatile. This is a little bit outside of our South Phoenix neighborhood, our Levine areas where we typically look at homes, but we don't think that this is really uh, 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 too far outside the scope of what we're doing, which is taking a look at everything that's available in the Arizona and the Phoenix market, everything from an HOA to no HOA to old to new to remodel to broken down needs repair everything gets a chance with us but this is a beautiful home this is a great area I'm very familiar with it uh, me and my family went to the school right around the corner heard elementary so great area nice restaurants down the street they're doing a big remodel of Tri-City Mall that's right on Central and Thomas so there's a lot going on in the area and it's close to everything and the home has a lot of potential. So hopefully you liked it. Give us any comments, give us any feedback. Let us know what you think about the home. If this you like it, you don't like it, what you think you would do differently. If this was your home, leave those comments in the box. Let me know what you think. Anyways, thank you for watching. God bless, take care until the next one. Talk to you soon.